It's the end of the homeschool year and I think it went great. Everything went just as I planned it. Let's hear from the kids and see what they think. Hey guys, it's Fani from Mrs. Mom's Homeschool and today I am doing a collaboration with other mothers asking our kids some end of the school year questions. If you're new to my channel, I am a homeschooling mom to three children and I make videos on homeschooling, day in the life, and motherhood. So make sure you check out my playlist and subscribe for more content and make sure to ring the bell so you're notified whenever I upload a new video. So I have three children, two of them are homeschooled and my oldest daughter went to public school for the first time this year. So when I'm asking her her questions, they'll be geared more towards her school year. And if you want to see what the kids all thought about this school year before it even started, check out the video on the card above because that was their before school interview. And it's amazing to see how much they've changed and grown in a year. Let's hear what my three kids had to say about this school year. Hello, Miss Arlen. Today I'm gonna ask you some questions about the last day of school, okay? Okay. How old are you? Shake your head. Shake your head. I was staring for too long. <laughs> how old are you? Four. Four. Aaron, how old are you? Nine. Hey, Kaylee, how old are you? Four. And what grade did you just finish? I'm four, and I just finished. And I just finished preschool. Good. And I wasn't even five yet. You weren't. What grade did you just finish? Third. What grade did you just finish? Seventh. How do you feel about when we do school together and we learn and we do all the different things together? How do you feel about that? Do you like it? Do you not like it? I love it. You love it? Yeah? That makes me happy to hear you say you love it. How do you feel about school and learning? I don't like it that much. Why not? It's really long. How do you feel about school and learning? I like it. What is your favorite thing we did this year? Let's think about all the things we did this year. It wasn't today. No, I didn't say today. I said this whole school year, all of pre-K. What was the most fun thing? What was your favorite thing that we did? Wait, what were you saying? Dinosaur World. You had a lot of fun when we went to Dinosaur World? Yeah. What was your favorite thing we did this year? What? Um, Dinosaur World. Dinosaur World, the field trip? Yeah. Yeah. What was your favorite thing that you guys did this year? I didn't have a favorite thing. I just like being with my friends. Being with your friends? Yeah. What is something interesting that you learned about this year? Can you remember? Uh, we learned about monkeys and elephants and penguins. We learned about birds. Birds. What about birds? They make nests before they get their eggs out. Very good. What is something interesting you learned about this year? Monkey. Monkeys. Monkeys? You like when we talked about the, the primates? Yeah. What is something interesting that you learned about this year? Genetics. Uh -huh. Like, with the alleles and stuff, it's just weird. What didn't you like about school this year? What did I not like? What did you not like? I guess that one thing I did not like. I loved everything. Ah, I love that. What didn't you like about this year? The hard parts of math. Okay. What didn't you like? I didn't like NHD. Which is what? National History Day. Why? So it's like this huge project. It's really hard. What was the hardest thing you had to do this year? Well, there's one thing that wasn't that hard. What? I, I couldn't do the... 
remember when, when Kelly had to help me do the shape, glue the shape on? Gluing shapes on? Yeah. Yeah. How about writing your name? Was that hard to learn how to write all the letters in your name? No. Took you a little while to do it. But it didn't take long. How about reading? Was that hard? Uh, I kept getting the end like too small. Yeah. So I had to get it bigger. Yeah. Like, like the A's and the R's and the A's. Well, you did a great job. And what was the hardest thing you had to do this year? Math. Math? What was the hardest thing you had to do this year? None of it was like hard, but like getting the schedule right, like waking up early. That was the hardest part. Can you talk a little louder? Waking up early on what? That was the hardest part. That was it. Waking up early every day? Yeah. To be at school at a certain time? Yeah. What would you like to do more next school year? I'm thirsty. You're thirsty? Yeah. <laughs> okay, go get something to drink. What would you like to do differently next school year or do more of? I like to do more science. More science? Good. We are going to do more science. What would you do? What would you like to do more of or differently next school year? I want to go to a different school for school because like, I feel like my school is too small. So. Are you better now that you have your drink? Can we continue with the interview now? What would you like to do more of next year? Okay. What do you want to be when you grow up? A doctor who gives people water and candy to make them feel better. <laughs> like I did it, I remember. What do you want to be when you grow up? A video game. What do you want to be when you grow up? I'd probably be like a doctor. If I couldn't be like an actress, I would be like a doctor. We want to do all summer break when we don't have school. Play Roblox. Okay, play Roblox. <laughs> what do you want to do all summer? Play Roblox. <laughs> you and Ireland can play Roblox together all summer. <laughs> what do you want to do all summer? I just want to hang out with friends. Okay. What's something you think would be fun to learn about next year? Castles, okay. What's something you think would be fun to learn about next year? Um, animals. We did a whole, you know, animal, animal, animals. More. The ones that we didn't learn about. More animals? All right. What's something you think would be fun to learn about next year? The medieval times, because like, I've learned about it, we didn't like, go in like, deep. I don't want to know more about it. So what advice would you give to mommy this year? I love you so much, I don't want to get blocks. Aww. Yeah. <laughs> well, thank you, Erlen. Thank you for your interview. Guess what? You're all done. Then you go drink your drink and play on the floor and do whatever it is you were trying to do while I was interviewing you. Goodbye. Yeah, your turn. Okay, so what advice would you give to your teacher? I would like to do more mining starters and Okay, can you explain really quickly what our mining starters were? Or what, what is a mining starter? Mining starters are like different games. Chess, on Fridays it could be Roblox. Geography puzzles. Bike rides. So it's something that we do before we start school. Yeah. Okay, we'll do that. We'll do that every day, okay? Thank you for your answers. I love you, goodbye. And what advice would you give to your teacher? Keep everything interesting. No matter what. All right, well thank you. So now I have an eighth grader, a fourth grader, and a kindergartner. Yep. Thank you for your time. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure, like I said before, to subscribe and check out the playlist for more content. The next videos will be some homeschool curriculum for my kindergartner and my fourth grader. And I will see you next time. Can you sit up for me? Stop turning the camera on. When I do the interview lap, I sit down and feel good. Okay. Oh my God, Aaron, stand to look at mommy.
What about when we did the, the birds? When we got to see the birds fly away and all that, and build their nests and lay their eggs, wasn't that interesting? We never did that. Oh my gosh. We never did that? No. What else? Tell me one thing that was interesting that you learned about this year. I just want to play because I'm having fun. Arlen, can we finish the interview and then you can go play?